Let's start right away with Vicuña. The story of Vicuña actually began over a break period, uh, sort of after another project, Alpacas. And the idea was to use a self-instructor, a method to train the Llama model to behave more like a chatbot, um, using something like ChatGPT as a guidance mechanism. Uh, and so they built this data set, which is pretty clever, actually. One of the things that's important to know in this entire kind of revolution of large language models is that data is critical to success. We downloaded, uh, I think, 800 megabytes of data using the public APIs for the Share GPT uh, website. Uh, and then the students took that data, the alpaca training scripts, and they basically put the two together. Uh, there's a little bit of work the students did. This will blow your mind. They removed the HTML tags from the data. Um, they did a little bit of additional cleaning, uh, and they fed that data into, again, the alpaca training scripts and fine-tuned the model, and out came Vicuña. 